What's up, everyone? Happy Tuesday. So we switched this We Ride at Dawn thing up. We Ride at Dusk this week. Uh, switch it up a little bit. Uh, I've been getting up in the morning. I've been sleeping in a little bit. Uh, trying to make sure this COVID doesn't get me. So uh, make sure I get in my sleep. And then when I get up, the baby wants to play Peppa Pig. So we play Peppa Pig with the baby in the morning and uh, chill out with the kitties and taking this time to ease up a little bit and enjoy. Um, unplug a little bit from the madness and plug in a little bit to the uh, stuff I've been neglecting, like my kitties. So the baby mm -hmm. wants to play Peppa Pig in the morning. We play Peppa Pig. That's what we do. Uh, she's four and uh, she's my last baby. The other ones are getting too big. Although last night I got to hang out with Kate. But 11 o'clock, she was like, Dad, there's nothing that has to eat. I said, you want to go on a run? So we jumped in the truck and we went to 7-Eleven and we got ice cream and we got potato chips and all kinds of junk food. And we went home and we had our own, our own little party, me and Kate, my oldest daughter. So that was fun. So uh, enjoying this time home with them, plugging in a little bit and thinking about the new year, thinking about this year, the accomplishments that uh, have gone on, goals I've met, goals I'd still like to meet. And uh, it got me thinking about next year and, and this whole thing we call life. And something I was thinking about is um, who do you expose yourself to? What do you expose yourself to? I'm not talking about getting naked, get your mind out of the gutter. I'm talking about what books do you read? Uh, what TV shows do you watch? What podcasts do you listen to? Um, what people do you surround yourself with? Um, who is in your life? Who are you exposed to? Who are you learning from? Um, it's really easy to get caught in our own little bubble. It's really easy to get caught in the same routine, same hamster wheel we talk about a lot. Um, and in order to break out of the, the, the where you're stuck in the grind, uh, you need to expose yourself to some new things, some new activities, some new ideas, some new people, some new places. Um, what are you exposing yourself to that's going to make your life different, make your life better? Um, this year, I uh, exposed myself to traveling to Texas and being around this group called Apex. You hear me talk about a lot. A lot of amazing humans doing amazing things. Uh, definitely not average humans. Definitely not stuck in a hamster wheel. These are all people that are uh, blazing their own trail. Uh, big, crazy ideas. And not just in business, but also in life. Um, doing big things. Um, and... That exposure has changed my outlook a lot on life, has changed what I'm focusing in on, changed my priorities, changed my goals, um, really has changed my complete mindset overall um, for the better. Um, I realized there was stuff in my life I'm neglecting that I need to do better on, like hanging out with my babies. And I realized that um, there's different parts of my business that I need to be concentrating on and my friends and certain people in my life that I need to concentrate on and how to be a better person every day. Um, put my head on a pillow every night, knowing I'm making the world a better place. Um, obviously these messages that I give to you every day, the bike rides, 211 days in a row, we're riding a bike. And uh, it's all just different exposure I've had this year. And putting on making a wish list of what I wanna expose myself to next year and continue exposing myself to. So there's your message of the day. What are you exposing yourself to? Who are you exposing yourself to? Um, it's going to change your life. Surround yourself with some new stuff that'll inspire you. Fire starts fire. We talk about it all the time. All right. We got to do prayers for the day. We are wearing a helmet today. Those of you will be happy to see that. All right. We're down here at Bay Park. We're over here by the water. All these houses on the water here. All right. Let's get our prayers in for the day. In the name of the Father, Son, Holy Spirit. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Dear God, help us to be inspired by those around us. Help us to get out of our comfort zones and help us to Expose ourselves to new opportunities, uh, new ideas, new people, uh, new places, uh, new dreams. Uh, help us to just keep growing every day and help inspire those around us to grow. Amen. 
All right, so we're going to finish the ride. Go home play with the kitties a little bit more. We got some more Peppa Pig to do. And uh, it's important, Peppa Pig's got her own house from Christmas, and now we're going to play with the Peppa Pig figures in the house. We got the bike out, we're all lit up for night. We got the headlights, and we got flashing lights, and we got the hand warmers and the cup holders. And uh, we got uh, Brian McKendrick's sure it's a Texas cup over here, getting the hydration going. All right, everyone. So hope you're having a great week. Uh, a couple of days left of this year to celebrate our wins and plan for the future. Let's go. Let's make a difference this year uh, coming up. Let's, uh, let's do big things together. All right, everyone. God bless. Love you all. Have a great night.